human-centered approach is to design a service, a product or a process, thinking about the end user. How can I make a product or service that creates a more valuable, meaningful, better, richer life for this person? Well, at the same time, considering and how do I minimize the cost to the natural environment? For the first time in history, we're not looking back and saying, oh, this happened? This was the consequences of the third industrial revolution? Now we're standing on the brink of the fourth, and we still have the time to shape how it's going to play out. First of all, diversity. We have had white Western men taking a lot of decisions on behalf of the whole world for a long time. Secondly, I think interdisciplinarity. It's both understanding technology from a technological point of view, from a social point of view, from a humanistic point of view. And that requires a conversation about what type of work would we like in the future. Maybe some of that will be remunerated for work of taking care of my elder parents. Maybe some of that will be remuneration for community work. Instead of just discussing how do we make small reforms to our social security system or to our education system, we need to talk about what is the end goal.